Welcome to TCM Safety Induction Training. My name is Vicky, and I will be your guide throughout this session. Your safety is our utmost concern. Therefore, we seek your cooperation by adhering to our standard operation procedures in the mining area. Let's begin. In order to get to the mining site, you have to drive in a proper light vehicle. Due to the harsh road condition, only four-wheel drive cars are allowed. As we get nearer to the site, there will be many heavy vehicles on the road. This presents risk of drivers of taller vehicles unable to see your car. We are using this flag pole in front of the car as visual cue for taller vehicles. The pole has to be 4 meters tall. After reaching the site, you must park within the designated zone. Make sure you do a reverse parking, and honk three times as the signal. All personnel entering the site must wear proper personal protective equipments or PPE. There are seven basic PPEs that must be worn at all times inside the mining site. 1. Safety helmet to protect against any head trauma or injury. 2. Safety vest with reflective tape for better visibility. 3. Safety goggles to protect your eyes against dust and debris. 4. Earplugs to protect your eardrums against loud noises. 5. Steel toe boots to protect your feet from heavy objects. 6. Face mask to prevent breathing dust and other air pollutants. 7. Hand gloves to protect against abrasion and cuts. There might be different PPE requirements for some special areas. Please check with your supervisor. Blasting is a procedure which requires special attention. Only explosive experts are allowed to enter the blasting area. Make sure you carefully read the notice board to know the timing. After explosives have been set and ready to fire, there will be countdown from 9 to 1 with 2 seconds interval between each count. 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 fire After the blast, make sure that the explosive experts has given permission before entering. This concludes our safety induction briefing. To test your understanding of our safety procedures, you will be given a series of questions. You have to score at least 80% in order to pass the test. Let's begin.
Thank you for your participation in TCM safety induction training. We hope you can actively help in keeping our workplace safe and secure. We wish you all the best.